10 seconds remaining. Five seconds remaining. I just think that there's a lot of defensive potential for both heroes, and I don't think that... I mean, Shiki's a second place TI finisher. Weao's got a lot of experience in the mid lane. He's oh, bottom right lane. Team. There's Nine Stalker. Searing chains by a little bit more time for the for the wall to come up, and Nine Stalker cannot run away in time. So I get to be wrong. Will be Pile I die. I think they're gonna get Realize two two. drop and uh, yeah, he's already used Icarus dive. So Phoenix, he's dead. This isn't a jungle hero. Don't okay. bother fire spiriting. Shiki's in a lot of trouble, but then again, he kind of wants to be. Weehan's coming in a little bit too far for this one. The Sonic Wave will turn around. That, that was some damage, but still. Top lane, Misery now in trouble, Night Stalker rotating in, and this is making the most out of the night time for the, for the NS. Exactly what he wants to have happen, Misery's trying to juke him left and right, but it's not going to be possible. Got it with a safe TP out. He felt the giant strength delivered, and Weeha is actually really far pushed forward. There's that Shadow Strike hitting again with the Void, he wants to try and finish with the Power Shop, gonna miss it. Oh, and now Weeha is in way too far the wall, trying to keep the Night Stalker away, but he cannot do it. Night Stalker reaching over the wall, she can actually very aggressively blinking forward. And that's something that most teams, that's the number one thing you rely on, is knowing where everybody is on the map, being able to kind of work around in team fights and call out signs. But you can't really do that when you're playing against a Night Stalker. And this is this, this is the classic C deck move, where they're going to gank into this jungle. Unfortunately, they're not going to run into the Ember Spirit first, but Puppy's a good consolation prize. Yeah, they're, they're fine with this. He's looking for most likely Puppy. And probably gonna find him. He doesn't have a TP for this, so he might want to bottle up first. There's a Radiant Sentry one though. He'll walk in range of this and now Puppy, okay. It may not matter anyway. Let's the Sonic Wave rip and Puppy with a Blink Scream. Chargers will not be able to save him. He doesn't have the TP though. Um, and his Blink's on cooldown. Yeah, that was... Misery's easy. coming. The Bottle Charts are kicking in, however. Pylai die. Still with that Glimpse available. Shiki, yeah, he's dead. The calculating damage. But at bottom, this again, this DDC move. They can invade the jungle. They it's can about see to him. hit nighttime, and Misery would be a huge pickup. It is a level 7 hero, he's got 1900 gold built up. Blowing him down here would be so huge for them. <laughs> that helps. Ember Spirit actually jumps himself over, so Eternal Envy want to be part of this. Is willing to invade their your jungle as 5 constantly. They're willing to bring over their safe lane carries just to be able to do so. They well, they found Weeha. Ulti gonna go off, Weeha dying almost instantly with a spin to ensure the kill. And they'll instantly TP themselves up to the top, and that's what uh, I know we were talking about this before we started. Okay, maybe he doesn't have spin. Uh, yeah, he's in a lot of trouble. Has to get to the tree line, the healing ward, the plague ward kills it off. And aggressive just turns for a moment because there's more support on the way in. Misery just frows himself up so they don't have any vision of him, but that just means the puppy will end up dying. With a shadow strike on him, he can't run away in time, and in fact, Shiki just wants to ensure the kill. But the shackle again from Weeha. I say again, because we just remember what happened yesterday. Is able to find that initiation, but Eternal Envy's got no mana. He needs extra help, but they go for the silence instead over on Weeha to keep him out of this fight, but he already got the shackle of the Night Stalker with the Wrath of Nature kicking in, that poison really hurting the Phoenix as both the Nova and the Poison Sting. And then the wall is there. They lock down Shiki. Phoenix will pop as well as Puppy just chased him down. So you want to try to get aggressive as quick as you can. And as soon as I say that again, CDEC, they're going to smoke up. <laughs> uh, Envy? Running off to, okay, that's the reason why he's got himself a spirit, but yeah, bottom lane is where the Night Stalker is, and uh, where the Night Stalker will be able to survive. He's got enough one charges, he'll survive through the Thunderstrike, but he won't survive through both the Wrath of Nature as well. Pilot IT being out, you have to commit the Sonic Wave to ensure that kill. I would kind of agree with you if they weren't TPing in the front as well. Yeah, when everybody kind of shows well, themselves like hello that, bottom the lane. Bottom. goodbye Disruptor, goodbye Venomancer. The Omni Slash doing the work, and of course Lion's Finger of Death. The way to start that fight, we are forced to get back behind the tower. We want to try to keep her alive, let her use her blink a little oh, bit more. Oh, nice shackle. We are hitting Shiki perfectly. Has he got enough damage to the Wrath of Nature? Yes, he does. I can see, though. He's found Pylai die. Yeah, Pylai is going to make it difficult for him with the wall as well as the ulti being used, but you got Night Stalker Illusions, which keep the vision on Pylai die. He will get the silence off, but not the void. Guard is too far away. Finger of Death coming off cooldown. So Puppy lets the ulti loose. Secret, are they going to try and fight this one? Considering, okay, yeah, Phoenix has to go into the Nova. He was dying too quickly. They also have to move that healing ward away from the trains and away from the play quads. Eternal Envy simple snipes slide. one. Yeah, that simple slide of fist. Windrange is going to find another over on the Phoenix. And now into that ulti. Eternal Envy completely isolated, which means that full Omni Slash just goes into the Ember Spirit. Misery gets a double sprout. They're TPing out in time. Will they? No. The glimpses, the shackles, and the spin from Aggressive. He's just not fast enough. He's Nova and Poison synced up, so Puppy... 
Well, he helps Weeha go for the solo kill. Egg Seed's on the run away from Puffy as well as from Misery. Who's going to find the kill first? Aggressive. Okay, Weeha going to get Orchid. And Shadow Strike, Sonic Wave. He'll find the kill. Is there enough from Queen of Pain? Yes, there is. Just to try and deal with the Venomancer? Uh, I think uh, maybe the Phoenix middle lane, but she that's can... troublesome. That positioning was perfect from Weeha, but this time Phoenix Nova, a better position for him. Weeha's gonna drop, Shiki will survive through this. Care of the Courier is just delivering. An aggressive will come to mop it up. Looks like top lane, the TP's out. Garda, well, he'll go for the stun, but the glimpse, it stops XZ as well. So Garda will get slider fisted down by the Ember Spirit. The wall doesn't control XZ, but the Sprout will. He's got no way out of this one, no TP's available. He just buys his Ogre Club and throws out whatever abilities he can, but this will be the two supports of C for CD Juggernaut just to try and take out Roshan a little bit earlier on. Give him advantage during these fights. Okay, we are. Is he really going for this? With a jump in from the Phoenix. No way. Now they're pushing him back. The Glimmer Cape arrives at the perfect time, but no, the ulti from the Disruptor as well as Puppy, coating almost all of CDEC. Aggressive can't get the ulti off. Shiggy will get a good Sonic Wave, but how much damage more can he do? He'll pick up Puppy. But that's all. Weeha's running after him. Stay away he from is. the trees. So you do not get shackled. He's going to get actually searing chained up anyway. Rotate forward. You can't give this up for free. This is one of CDC's better moments. They're coming. But you don't have the heroes for The him. Phoenix is here. He starts the Sunray. And Roshan's already practically dead. They'll go into the Nova. That just means you got a Nova oh, he inside the pit. Like Weeha, where is the control? Does no one be there? The double one from Garda with a finger of death. They bring down Eternal Envy. Misery is burning as well. He wants to TP himself out of here. Weeha still locked inside the pit. Now into the Omni Slash. Weeha will drop. Misery lucky to escape out of that one with his life. But see Shows they rotate over. And then Eternal Envy just goes to the opposite side of the map with his boots of travels. And he sees on the run. The four man smoke move. This is so smart by them too. They the have the ward vision, they know he's there. They should just go for the blind blink up. There it is, from Garda, able to get it, and with the Hex, including the Finger of Death, they really did not want Envy to get out of this one. This yeah. is gonna prompt Secret to get aggressive, and you're seeing that right now as they're moving forward as... Lazano for next Z. The Shackle, it won't latch into the Omni Slash. Weeha trying to evade most of this, but he's gonna get hit by every single bit with a Sonic Wave to ensure the kill. The Nova made it difficult to escape, and Pylai die. Finger of Death as well. C Deck, they're being very liberal with their ultimates. That would be the best way. Just burn out the Omni Slash. Obviously, you still attack the uh, heroes, which Ghost have. You just don't do any damage, Puppy. Oh, there's your stun. They jump forward with the Orchid. He should pop from this anyway. The Sunray making it, yeah, pretty much in short. 20. Oh, the shackle. Very rarely does Weeha miss things like that. He'll get punished for it too. They turn on the Orc and the Sonic Wave as well. Weeha's down. He's got buyback. Oh, they're coming in. There's your first slide of fist up here in chains. The BKB from Night Stalker off very quickly. They go for the Nova, but the secret, they're already so far away from the Nova. That push with the four staff away, Pardai, he will go down. The ulti comes out from Puppy, but it only hits Garner as well as XZ. Aggressive is just having so much fun over on the side. Puppy attempted to TP out. He'll be successful, even though he is burning inside the base. The Fire Spirits, they can't finish the job. Oh, that damage from this Juggernaut is so much. And he cut through. They'll find Misery. Just Misery trying to poke for anything. Always keep C Deck looking behind themselves. That's the goal of the Nature's Prophet. And Puppy. Well, okay. There's the BTs forward. They four staff down the line. Really and that like allows the aggressive to blink forward. The finger of death will come, so the ghost of it cannot protect him. Pile high die. die! Aggressive! Just shredding him apart. And now they can go for more. The only slash is available. They don't even need it. That was a dieback by Puppy. He wanted to try and defend and keep them in base because Eternal Envy is pushing through the top. But now as Cedar comes up here, and where is Envy Spirit? It's a long way back at base. All the way home. The calculated risk. But right now it's all risk. Shiki atop. You've got a hex? Oh, this is this is problematic. Divine Rapier was actually picked up as oh, well. No. This is there's a rapier in the hands of a juggernaut. He drops his S and Y for this he one. He just got that too. He doesn't have buyback now too on Nature's Prophet. That just slows everything. Down. Here they come. We are instantly hexed up. They will be having the Nova as Pylite die in the back lines that Garda is focusing. Take out one of the supports before the fighting begins. They don't really have anything more to gain by taking out this mid lane uh, as far as the racks go, but right now they're just hunting kills. Trouble on Q, we huh? able to find that pick off. They're doing this all without their monster juggernaut. She's got that. Boots of travel number two, she's just gonna TP back. And every. 
side of Fist and get the hell out of there. Because they're right behind you. He'll get actually sealed up. They can lock, in, lock him in right now. With also Shiki going for the Orchid and Sonic Wave. There it is. Just man moding this in CDEC. You get the Nova out. Now, can they get rid of this in time? The answer is going to be no. The Egg will hit the deck. And Puffy getting fingered down. The Shackle connects again from Weeha with a focus fire. He really wants to kill off this face, but Phoenix still has the cheese. And then aggressive. Blinks forward. He's got the help from Garter who got the Hex off too. The only science is up and aggressive. If they can get this kill, they can't. They're going for the Fortress right now. CDEC, the spin from aggressive protecting him. And this will be the game. CDEC, oh, will it? No, it won't. The Shackle, it holds them. The Rapey on the ground, but they finish the job at the end. Ooh. It almost looked like CDEC had a bit of a fight at the, at the last moment, but CDEC, patience was a virtue they were asked to show. They eventually...